welcome back to Kitten Up Kitten. And as promised, I have two canvases from Diamond Art Studio, which arrived today. My name is Kitten Up Kitten, and I am Sam. And I'm going to be unboxing these tonight. So, camera angle is set up so you are seeing these from the side. So I will try and make sure that I get everything in frame, but you'll be seeing it from the side angle. Number one, I'm going to start with the small kit first. So I ordered these on Sunday. It is now Wednesday. They should have come yesterday. They didn't. Um, they came today while I was at work. Um, so I've literally, I've done a 12 hour shift today. I've come home. Here they are. And I'm going to unbox them. So number one, how beautiful is this wrapping? Um, we have a little card with all their details on. So that's nice. So I'm going to keep that where I can find it. I'm going to stick it to my wall. I'm going to undo this. No, I'm not because it fell off. I might keep that actually and stick it into my desk. Um, beautiful, beautiful wrapping. I don't want to unwrap it. It's that gorgeous. So I'm going to cut the tape on this paper. I mean, that is some skillful wrapping right there, isn't it? Really. I love this. It makes it so personal, I think. So I thought I'll start with the little one. I think I know which this one is. Okay. I could be wrong. Oh, I'm so excited. I've literally come home and they're sitting on the table and my mum's come down and gone, oh, look how pretty they are. And I'm like, yeah, I can't open them. Need to eat my dinner first. So, um... I do hope you will like. So just while I'm wrestling to get in this box, in this packaging, um, if you are new here, welcome to my channel. And if you are coming back, thank you for coming back. So we have our first one, that's the paper off. Comes in a really nice box. Has instructions on the back. So that's good. We've got a little. So this has surprised me because I thought it was the other way around. So inside this bag we have a kit. So I did order a kit because I've never bought from these before. So I thought it'd be interesting to see what we get in it. So we get. If I can get. These are quite nice bags actually. Um, can't get it out so we get a white boat with a funnel we of course get our diamond painting pen we get a pair of stabby tweezers which is always good to have you can have too many tweezers we also get a tub of blue wax we get what I think is a four placer and possibly a six placer they are the thin ones um, I don't actually know because I don't use multi placers and we get a squishy for the pen as well so that's not a bad kit I did order a kit with both just because I thought my mum could have a kit so let's put that back in there I won't obviously get the next one out as well so nice kit not bad have an idea for these as well so that's good so i can reuse that let's get this one out so first of all we have the drills okay so the drills are in ziploc bags which i actually like we do have a number on there so i did order both of these in a square i'm going to roll this back on itself it is a poured glue canvas and you will see why i have ordered it in a second 
So I ordered this one. How many colours did we have? We have 38 colours. And you'll see why I've ordered it. As you can see, this is by Patrice Marciano, I think it is. Patrice. Um, so this is by the same artist that um, did Chupa. Look at that. And again, I saw this and thought this would be perfect. Perfect for my um, salon. So I'm just going to get a tape measure. Seems as... I've never ordered from here before. So let's have a look. This is advertised as a 30 by 40. And we are 30 dead on. Just under 40. I mean, there's a little bit of creasing. So actually, by the time the creases have come out, it, it's literally a smidge short of 40. So I'm going to call that true to size, which is good. Um, no ABs in this one. Um, but I got it in a square because I figure it's harder for a company to do squares well. So I'm just going to turn it on its side while I peel this back and have a look. Get it nice and flat. There's some creasing where it's been wrapped around the drills, but that isn't anything that's not going to come out when you start working on it. It is that plasticky sheeting. Um, but, you know, I, I wouldn't expect to get the same type of canvas as I would get from Diamond Art Club. You know, it's not as expensive as that. Um, so, all told not too bad let's have a look at these symbols i'm just getting the air bubbles out because i hate that hate having air bubbles not that i'm a perfectionist or anything so let's have a look at these this drill field so first of all we'll have a look i'm going to lift it up so I'm hoping that you can see. So, looks pretty clear. Um, bit of confetti there. But there's nothing there that I think will cause me any trouble. So let's have a look, see what we've got. We've got a mix of letters, numbers and symbols. Yeah, looks pretty good. So pleased with that. So of course we do have Diamond Art Studio across the top here. We also have their Facebook and Instagram details down here. We have that it's from their Platinum Collection. I think this will go perfectly in my studio with the other one. So I'm really pleased with that. Let's have a look. So we don't have an inventory sheet. Um, so that means I'm either going to have to scan or copy this to make my labels. Or um, I'm going to have to cut it off, I guess. So I could just cut one of the legends off for this too. So let's have a look at these. I don't know if they're in order. Actually, it looks like they are. Oh, no, they're not. No, they're not. 4.14. It's the, there's no... The 310 aren't in order. But I think everything else is. So 310 would actually go there. So let's have a look at these 310. Um, there is no air in this bag at all. So again, you can't really tell until you start working on it, but I'm not seeing any trash at all. Let's have a look at this big bag of 3865. 
Oh, as if I didn't have enough of these last time. Yeah, they look pretty good. There's not a lot wrong there that I can see. As far as I'm aware, these are resin drills. So I'm not going to pull all these out because I don't want to pull them out of sequence because they're in order. But they look pretty good. Right, let's try 3072. So let's have a good look at those. Yeah, they look good. I think they are resin, definitely. They're very, very flat on the bottom. They look very, very good. You can see them lining up here, look. Can you see? Please, with that. Not got a clue where that goes now. 3072. Yeah, in there. So let's put them back. So I'm not going to get them all out. Um, I'm happy with that. Looks good. I was very surprised because I thought the other picture was going to be the bigger one. Shows how much I check the sizes, doesn't it? So I'm going to roll this one back up. I will, of course, be kitting up very soon. I'm going to put it back in the box just so that I can keep it all together. I'm not going to add the kit in because I should give my mum one. And then we're on to the second. So again, another beautifully wrapped box. There's some caretaker. I can't wrap Christmas presents this well. So actually, I'm very impressed and I'm also slightly concerned that this picture is going to be bigger than I expected it to be. Um, which is a bit of a pain because uh, I was hoping to do this one for a gift. Oh, it's so cute. So I didn't want to open this um, before doing it on camera for the reason that I wanted my reaction to be real. But like I said, I wanted to try other companies as well. So I'm hoping over the next months or weeks to be trying different companies to give you my view. Again, this is a square diamond painting, poured glue and resin drills. I would say it is a high quality canvas, um, but it's, it's not diamond art club canvas. But I can forgive that because the price was a lot different. So let's pull the drills out. Again, your kit. So we won't look at that again. I'll put the drills to one side. So again, actually it's not as it's not that big. Um, I didn't want to get massive ones just for the simple reason. It's a new company, I've not tried them before. So it is that polyester stuff, it is a, a little bit stiff. But we'll see how it goes. And I will pull back the paper. So the second one. How cute is that? Oh my word. Um, I wanted to do this for my daughter. She loves owls. Um, there is 26 colours in this one which is kind of cute. It is advertised as a 40 by 40, so let's give it a measure. I'm very excited, love the colors in this one. So let's, oh, helps if you get it the right way around. So let's have a look, 40. Yeah, you see, that's going to be 40 by the time that's flattened out. So it is true to size, which is fabulous. I'm just going to pull this back. Like I said, I'm impressed with the, um, the quality of the symbols. Let's have a quick look. Clear. Clear as a bell. Looks good. 
So let's flatten that one down. I've got a little piece of cotton or something on there. Or is it a mark? Mm, looks like a little bit of cotton on there. I'll get that out of the tweezers later on. I was quite surprised. There's 26 colours, actually. I didn't think they'd be that many. Um, so again, same canvas as before. Um, what I do like is the fact that these are licensed images. I love that, as you know. Um, the only thing that I would say from going on the website was they don't have masses yet. Um, they are a relatively new company. I'm not personally a fan of Splatterworks, but um, I do like this one. I forget who this is by, so I apologise. If I find out, I will put it in the description box below. But I love the big eyes on this. It is absolutely stunning. Um, so very pleased with those. Let's turn this over. Canvases on the back are perfect. There's, there's nothing there to cause me concern. Drills again all in baggies. And I do like that because I will reuse the bags until they start falling apart. Um, and it does make it easier when you're picking up. Not having to, uh, yeah, I don't know if they're all in order again. But let's just have a look at some of these squares. So again, a square. Because as far as I'm concerned, if a company can do the squares right, their rounds will probably be fine. Yeah, look pretty good to me. There's no trash in there. Looks all right. Have we got any 310? No, they're 939. Again, can't see any trash. They're very shiny, which is nice. Yeah, looks good. Looks good. So again, not going to pull them all out. Um, so they are my two Diamond Art Club. Uh, sorry, not Diamond Art Club. Got Diamond Art Club on the brain. Those are my two um, Diamond Art Studio pictures. I do hope you like. I'm looking forward to giving one of these a go. And they're a nice snack size as well, which I really like. So um, definitely Patrice Marcel. I'm really surprised they don't have the artist's name on them, which is surprising. I think that would be nice if they had the artist's name as well. Just the thought, Diamond Art Studio. However, we shall see. Oh my God, that's so cute. Isn't it? You can see it better if it's laid down just because of the glare. That is such a cute owl. Um, yeah, just, just as uh, I mentioned Diamond Art Studio, maybe having the artist's name on there would be good. But so far, I'm impressed. So I look forward to kitting these up. I look forward even more so to doing them. So that is Snowy Owl. I can't remember what this lips one is called. I'm sorry. Um, but to have the two in the uh, in the summer house when it's done will be amazing. Um, very, very similar. Some of the symbols are very, very similar to Diamond Dark Love. Um, so like I said, you know, it's not, they're not, there's not a wrinkle on the back look. They're very good. So, yeah, I look forward to having a go. So that is it from me. I will be back at some point, I'm sure, with a kitten up um, for these two. So these will now go into my stash. And uh, that is it from me this evening. Thank you very much for joining me today. If you do like what you have seen, please do 
like and subscribe and hit that notification button so that you will be notified when I post again. Thank you very much for joining me. It is, as always, from Kitten Up Kitten, over and out. Bye for now.